Welcome to our video discussing the recent news about Signature Bank insiders selling over $100 million in stock during the crypto surge. In this video, we'll explore the details of this story, including how the transactions went unnoticed by investors and the aftermath of the bank's collapse. Stay tuned to learn more. Insiders at Signature Bank sold more than $100 million worth of shares in the years after the bank began attracting cryptocurrency companies. The sales included those by the bank's chairman, its former CEO, and his successor. The sales over the past three years were not widely known because of how they were described in the documents and where they were filed. New York regulators put Signature into receivership on March 12, following a run on its deposits triggered by the collapses of other banks. SVB and Signature were respectively the second and third largest bank failures in U.S. history after Washington Mutual. It was a steep and sudden fall for Signature, a bank that was one of a small number of lenders to embrace the cryptocurrency industry. The executives sold many of their shares in the spring at around $220. The stock continued to rise throughout the year, hitting an all-time high of $366 in early 2022. In a hearing last week, members of the Senate Banking Committee were critical of the bank's executives saying they sat by while risks at their banks grew unchecked. The executives responsible for overseeing the bank's risk were also champions of its courting of the crypto industry. That strategy focused on an internal payments platform called Signet that was used by crypto companies to manage their cash. That's all for now. If you liked the video, please hit the like button and leave a comment. Also, subscribe to our channel for more informative videos.